Good morning, Bayview family. It is Wednesday, August 4th, 2021. We have our three lectionary readings for the day. Our psalm reading is Psalm 107, 1, 2, and 3, and then we jump over 33 through 43. Our Old Testament reading is Isaiah 55, 1 through 9, and then our New Testament reading is coming from the Gospel of Mark, chapter 8, verses 1 through 10. Let us listen in to our psalm reading. O oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so, those he redeemed from trouble, and gathered in from the lands, from the east and from the west, from the north and from the south. He turns rivers into a desert, springs of water into thirsty ground a fruitful land into a salty waste because of the wickedness of the inhabitants. He turns a desert into pools of water, a parched land into springs of water. And there he lets the hungry live, and they establish a town to live in. They sow fields and plant vineyards and get a fruitful yield. By the blessing they multiply greatly. And he does not let their cattle decrease. When they are diminished and brought low through oppression, trouble, and sorrow, he pours contempt on princes and makes them wander and trackless wastes. But he raises up the needy out of distress and makes the families like flock. The upright see it and are glad, and the wicked stop its mouth. Let those who are wise give heed to these things, and consider the steadfast love of the Lord. Our Old Testament reading comes from the book of Isaiah, chapter 55, verses 1 through 9. Hear these words. Ho, oh, everyone who thirsts, come to the waters, and you that have no money, come, buy, and eat. Come, buy wine and milk without money and without price. Why do you spend your money for that which is not bread, and your labor for that which does not satisfy? Listen carefully to me, and eat what is good, and delight yourself in rich food. Incline your ear and come to me. Listen, so that you may live. I will be with you and make you an everlasting covenant. My steadfast, sure love for David. See, I made him a witness to his people. A leader and a commander for the people. See, you shall call nations that you do not know. And nations that do not know you shall run to you. Because of the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel. For he has glorified you. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Let the wicked forsake their ways and the unrighteous their thoughts. Let them return to the Lord that he may have mercy on them. And to our God, for he will abundantly pardon. For my thought are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my way, says the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways. And my thoughts, then your thoughts. Here is our New Testament reading. It comes from the Gospel of Mark, chapter 8, verses 1 through 10. Hear these words. In those days when there was again a great crowd without anything to eat, he called his disciples and said to them, I have compassion for this crowd because they have been with me now for three days and have nothing to eat. If I send them away hungry to their homes, they will faint on the way. And some of them have come from a great distance. His disciples replied, How can one feed these people with the bread here in the desert? He asked them, How many loaves do you have? And they said, Seven. Then he ordered the crowd to sit down on the crowd. And he took the seven loaves. After giving thanks, 
he broke it and gave it to them, to the disciples, to distribute. And they distributed them to the crowd. They also had a few small fish. And after blessing them, he ordered that they too should be distributed. They ate and were filled. And then they took up the broken pieces left over. Seven baskets full. Now there were about 4,000 people and he sent them away. And immediately he got into the boat with his disciples and went to the district of Dalmuta. And here ends our readings for the day. Have a beautiful day.